we're back for the NAB Show Centennial Event, the pinnacle event for all in the global broadcast, media, and entertainment industry. Capitalize, content, and create. We've got everything you could possibly need right here in Vegas. Ashley with In Broadcast. Joining me is Joao Net of Voice Interaction. Hello. Um, nice to see you again. You as well. So how is Voice Interaction positioned in the media and broadcasting industry right now, and what strategies is it implementing to stay ahead of the game, would you say? Um, voice Interaction has um, a very strong position in terms of the media and broadcast, basically because we are using AI-driven solutions, uh, and we starting by the automatic closed captioning solution, uh, which provides the broadcasts uh, a good solution in terms of the uh, transcription and automation of uh, that kind of uh, situations. Okay, and also we went to media monitoring solutions uh, with our solution MMS. That besides the compliance and the recording, gives also information about the content, having some knowledge about uh, that. And uh, that is relevant, both these products also have a solution for um, offline, uh, offline production. So joining me now is Ken Dillard, the new Voice Interaction VP of Sales. And this is your first show here with Voice Interaction at NAB. So how is the company keeping up with the industry trends and responding to the needs of U.S. broadcasters? Well, that's a great question. But I, I think we really actually set the trend and people are trying to keep up with us. Uh, our technology is... is advanced to a point where um, I don't think we got to keep up with anybody. Uh, it's very exciting, very exhilarating. I mean, we're, we're solving problems for folks that uh, sometimes they don't even know they have, which is a powerful thing. So I, I think we're, uh, we're the trendsetters. We're the thought leaders. Absolutely. Welcome to the team. I'm with Renato Casaca, Voice Interaction CTO. Hello. Hello. Hi. So how is Automus Media advanced closed captioning in the media and broadcasting industry with its latest technology updates? Uh, we are uh, supporting the transition to IP, so traditionally we, our system was working on SDI with SDI encoders embedding the captions into an SDI environment, but we are supporting that transition and we are uh, now we introduced the ST2110 uh, support. NDI and we also support uh, MPEG TS contributions. That means that we can uh, bypass closed caption encoders, but because right now we are able to deliver the subtitle streams directly to the uh, multiplexer that is available on the broadcast TV. I am with Joao Net, and he is the lead software designer. Hello. Hello. Hi. So Voice Interaction is presenting the latest version of your compliance solution. Yep. What can you tell us about MMS 7.0? Uh, last year we won the product of the year with MMS, the Nobshow product of the year. But this year we are trying to bring even more new features. So we redesigned the interface completely. Okay, It's much more user friendly now. And we are aiming to uh, use this product in all the departments of a TV broadcaster. Okay, So not just engineering, okay? but also marketing, sales, production, even the top uh, managers okay, can use the application. Okay? The application is very complete, very complete, very new features okay, that are very, very important, not just the compliance part, okay, but uh, we also bring in the news, news part, news segmentation, anchor segmentation, we are using a lot of AI. Okay? Um, and we are uh, creating a new, a new standard for broadcast compliance. So how is Voice Interaction planning to innovate and evolve in the future to meet the needs in the media and broadcasting industry? Basically what we have been doing is working to, to improve the core technology in our products and uh, basically trying to extend uh, the different kind of features that we are providing in our systems. Also we have been uh, expanding for the APAC region which is relevant on this and we creating new language models for that kind of uh, for that region okay and the idea is to to help the broadcasts to keep with the current demands and helping them and uh, with our systems and basically with the new release of version 7.0 of the different products we are bringing a set of new features to the market Thank you so much for speaking with us today, Joao. Thank you. Thank nice you. to see you again. You too.